welcome back to my channel today and we are doing a brand new sims 2 current household video but this time in strange town and this will be like the very first part you'll be seeing of this family but also the neighborhood and you're not familiar with my sims 2 like rotational quote-unquote gameplay i will leave a link down below in the description to the pleasant view one that i play here and there for you all to see but ultimately i wanted to kind of do a bit of a switch up and go to a new neighborhood where it's mystery chaotic and dramatic that i love and so we're starting with the grunt family and originally there are actually four sims living here but there's three now and i'll get into that a little bit later but there is general buzz grunt who is the father tank rip and buck tank is actually the oldest of the bunch and then rip is the middle child and then buck is the silly happy-go-lucky child that is really kind of more the hidden child but the backstory of this family is that tank here is wanting to be just like his father but ultimately can he really prove his worth to be his, to be to his demanding father we don't really know until it actually happens and so i'm gonna hop into this family and show you all what is really going down because I have a lot to uncover. So we are officially in the Grunt household in Strange Town, and Mr. Rip Grunt here is literally having a mental breakdown because he's not having any romance in his life and having the worst life ever. Ever since breaking up with Ophelia and not having anything going in his life after his father passing, he's been um having a bit of ups and downs lately with himself his life, his relationship with his with siblings, his friends, his everything. He doesn't even know what he wants to do when he, when he actually graduates from high school, if he graduates from high school. I'm kind of concerned for him, to be honest. So he actually have him skip school today because I don't really see him being in school for a very long time. I'm gonna open up this package that we got here today. But to give you a bit of a lowdown of these Sims and like their aspirations and everything in the relationships, Rip is actually wanting to have 10 spontaneously lovers. And that's like a lot of lovers that he's gonna have, which I don't think he's ever going to achieve but we'll see um rip grunt actually wants to be a media uh Ma magnate at level 10 of the writer career or journalism career which is going to be very interesting for him buck however is at school but he's more the forgotten child and doesn't really see the light of day doesn't get attention to anybody at any time except rip i believe i posted a speed build either before or after this video or something like that of rip's new newly house he's going to be living in after he gets out of this household because i don't really see him, him living in the house where he felt not wanted or needed at all and and ultimately he's gonna leave and probably rip like rip himself the shreds of not being who he wants to be because he's always been having this life where he thought he had to be the best of the best and be who his father wanted him to be but I don't think that's the case anymore where he just wants to have romance he wants to be himself he wants to be his own person like his bio literally says rip totally doesn't care what you think about him he's going to do whatever he wants to do which is mostly what everyone else is doing and so he's gonna do what he wants at any time at any at anywhere he wants to be and that's what he's gonna be like and rip i'm gonna probably have you go to school late because it's it's 9 a.m and or it's 10 a.m so let's go ahead and go to work go to school now we're just gonna go late i wanted him to like skip school but i feel like he should go to school now and go ahead of time just walk to school easy peasy and squeezy i also just realized that maybe we have a bigger lot than i thought wait we have a bigger lot than i thought we could have added a fixer upper car here and have rip fix it or tank who knows i don't really know Oh, but that could have been something that we could have done. Oh, well, next time. If you didn't see the stream, there was a time in the stream where um that General Buzz Grunt got electrocuted by lightning. What if he died? That would have been bad. What if he died? Oh my gosh, this poor child. This poor, this is a dysfunctional family. I can't with these Sims. These Sims are just out of control. They're so wild. Like, it's kind of funny how wild the Sims can be. Wait, if a player wants what wait what he died what no 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 what where where how who what are you sick you've got to be j where where's his gravestone where did he die where's grim what was i do i probably wasn't looking i didn't even see it what in the world i was like what if he dies i'm like well he died and if you don't remember the storyline of these sims actually is uh quite funny where the grunt family their, their mother rip tank and buck yeah, those three kids, their mother got electrocuted by lightning the day after she divorced their father. So it wasn't really good for them when that happened. But when General Buzz Grunt got electrocuted, Tank took it the hardest where he was not really happy. Well, he's happy now because he's got an A- in school. He's doing great. But Tank is, he's very... 
very devastated. He has a fear of seeing General Buzz as a zombie, which are going to lock that in, actually. But he also had a very hard time realizing that losing his father is something that he never wanted to see or happen. Like, this sim was so important to him that he couldn't imagine going on. Only time can ease my pain. And people always say in real life that, oh, get over it. They, you lost them like years and years ago. But ultimately, time, like, we need time to ease and we need time to heal. Like we just can't switch off our emotions like vampires and vampire diaries and forget our pain and suffering that we lost a loved one so many years ago. No, we have to remember them and we have to learn that we just can't forget who we love no matter where we are in life. This family has been going downhill very very quickly yeah tank is home tank can talk to you but as you can see here buck doesn't really have a lot of memories of anything he doesn't even remember his mother dying because she moved out of the house so long ago and ever since that it's like mm, who cares but let's have him do his homework real quick so we can get that done and out the way tank let's have you answer the phone of whoever is calling you first of all tank is actually going to be aging up today and so is buck but i'm going to actually have tank move out today before rip actually comes home because when you really think about it rip never really liked or well, yeah rip never liked tank and tank never liked rip and so ultimately i feel like ever since losing the, the father of the household rip just wants to move on and get out of this town get out of life and just move on and see where his, his life goes so i'm gonna actually have oh wait we have an, we have a chance card here for rip wait sitting in wait rip is sitting in his tiny sales kiosk listening to the sound of the rain and beating against the bullet blast glass bulletproof glass he has begun to debate whether he should eat yum wait yum co tiny cake or try one of the new flavors of mystery cheese food when a rancy new sports car pulls up the full service pump and honks the service Rip can go on break or just pretend not to notice i think he would actually really go on break but i feel like he's going to just pretend he didn't notice it oh oh no the hot headed in the sports car finally after 10 minutes of non-stop honking pulls up but pulls away in a cloud of smoke and burns rubber and a few minutes later rip's boss calls and looks like she's angry about something though rip has no idea what she is saying through the nearly unintendable accent words rip hangs up on her but discovers later that he has been docked a day's pay oh that's not good oh that's not good oh no wait when does he come home he comes on at six okay that's not good at all buck where are you at he's in bed no finish your homework please rip let's have you actually go over here to the computer let's see if we have applied for some scholarships i don't think we did but we might have some if we do that's good if we don't then we'll apply let's have him review accepted scholarships because i think he got the orphan one and then the fitness one and he might again the the scholar grant as well but let's see what we have here but scholarships oh we got the scholar grant and we got the orphan sims as, uh, assistance grant but why didn't we get the this no the fitness one oh because we have level we have level seven in our body skill no wonder he's gonna have a rough time but let's actually have him move to college today, like now, and get out of here before Rip comes home. Yes, Tank's about to leave his household and move to college. Are you sure you want this to you want to do this? Yes. For the sake of the storyline, it's gonna happen. Oh, a taxi is here to take take off to college and a new life as a young adult. Oh my gosh, this is gonna be so sad. Honestly, I feel like Tank is ready to leave ever since again losing his father. He's just been very spontaneous lately with his like endeavors and his life and the way he's been doing things on a day to day basis. That it's been kind of hard for him to realize that maybe this is the life that he needs to live where he needs to get out of like the town of where he grew up his parents lived his parents died and live his own life the way he wants to live it and i think that's what all the kids are doing nowadays but buck where are you at no say goodbye to your to your brother even though you kind of hated him or you loved him but didn't have a good relationship with him wait let's go run over here no run buck run he's running oh and he's gone oh no oh and there oh just in time oh no just in time wait what okay i wonder what rip is gonna think about this rip is like wait where's where's tank where did he go where did he go and then nobody's in this car because it's about to vanish but like rip is like oh my gosh what was that taxi doing here oh buck let's have you come downstairs he only earned 71 simoleons today. Oh no, okay. Wait, what? It's 6 p.m. Oh, I forgot. Sims do age up every single day at 6 p.m. That's fine. I mean, we only have like four days left until Tank is a teen, or Tank, no. Rip is an, an adult, which we're gonna have him age up anyway. But Buck looks cool. Wow. I thought he was gonna age up ugly, but no, he actually looks good. Now, we're gonna explain to Rip what actually happened because he doesn't know. All he knows is that simply Tank just left. Tank just left out of random. 
and he's like i'm gone i'm out like bro did you like i forgot to tell you tank left and he's like why why did tank leave like i don't know he just said i'm gonna up and leave and just get out of here get out of town and just leave and live my best life it's like oh really good riddance i never liked that kid anyway he's awful never knew what he was up to anyway we had a bad relationship and so i'm glad he's gone like rip is literally so overjoyed with himself right now that 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 tank is gone like i can truly believe that he does not care about rip whatsoever because how bad the relationship is so i might invite over johnny yeah i'm gonna invite over johnny i'm gonna clean this tank first and then probably feed the fish of who knows what but let's invite over johnny let's make let's make some friends for buck because he has no friends he literally has no friends besides samuel and jill that i'm gonna age up later on but like there's literally nobody here oh man i mean might as well make some friends with johnny at least play some catch oh no let's toss, let's toss the football but let's see he wants to have his very first kiss which i'm pretty sure he had with ophelia long time ago let's go and do a friendly hug i should stop cooking real quick oh sorry i'm sorry hi sir what are you what, what are you up to tell a joke he just stared into the void like he broke the fourth wall I'm like uh, i'm sorry but you can't uh look at me while i'm talking to you but i want to see if i can get a romantic relationship with jenny and rip before he's like an adult because i want to see if, it, if it'll work or not i'm not sure if it will but you know we'll have to see i don't know but i'm just kind of excited to see where 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 tank and rip no well yeah i guess tank too see where his like will go but also where rip and buck will head off in life but i think i'm gonna see what tank is up to in college because we need to start dealing out with his life at la vista tech since he only has two scholarships well one grant and one scholarship but this will be very interesting on how their life will pan out so apparently tank has already officially finished his first semester of university which is very very good but he hasn't been doing that well because he's very still undecided of what he wants to do with his life where he wants to go and how he wants to do and so personally i believe that one day he'll be able to achieve what he wants to do and still prove his father that i can be the best that i can be and be better than you and for his major i'm honestly thinking that he still should be in the political science or some type of like history major to determine that he will be in the military career because the one thing i love about the sims university is that it shows you the majors but also like the ideal careers and what skills you should focus a lot more on which is so perfect for tank because he he has a very good body skill but really doesn't have any other skills to really have him be successful and so the political science major it really just determines that he can be a lawyer a spy or some type of like secret agent a military uh person in politics or he can be in show business however for the history major still law military politics or an artist but i really don't see him being in the history major because personally what the description says it doesn't really go with the align. However, it's the study of the past from the paintings of the earliest cave sims from the last week of change menu on our local schools. Those who study history often go into the military service or politics due to their desire to reserve the mistakes of the past to make the better future for sim kind. So now that I think about it, maybe the history major is actually really good for him. We could go down the history route because he does want to change the history and the stigma of that you don't have to be a certain way to like be in the military career. You can do whatever you want. So maybe we can do that for him i mean i think we can always change our major later on if we wanted to so so let's have him work on this term paper for now so he can get done done and out the way ophelia actually is here and she's a sophomore and ophelia is part of the specter household with her grandma i think her aunt i'm pretty sure yeah her aunt where does it go her family tree here it is willow oh olive specter died that's right olive specter died and her son nervous subject is now living at their house that's right mm, you'll see that for another time but ophelia Ophelia is in university. She actually has, she's in the physics major as a sophomore, 4.0, doing really great for her. And then Stella over here is also a physics major as a freshman, but I don't really know what her family tree is like too. I'm not sure. Oh, it's just her. Okay. Well, she's alone. Who really knows? Because this could be really interesting if Tank and Stella or Tank and Ophelia get together just to spite Rip. Because Rip has a deep, deep relationship with, uh, yeah, Rip has a deep, deep relationship 
with Ophelia when they were teenagers. And so if Tank gets together with Ophelia, this could lead down to a very, very dark path for Tank and Rip. But anyway, I'm going to go ahead and actually wrap up this video right here. I hope you all enjoy today's current household of the Grunt family, Strange Town, all that jazz, seeing what Buck's life was like, Rip's life, and also Tank's life now. And I'm kind of excited to see where this leads off for the rest of them for the most part and hopefully this leads Tank to a whirlwind of success and hopefully not despair and destruction. That could all change if Rip moves in to this lovely university and and decides to actually be awful to his own brother but that won't happen because he's not going to the university anyway. He's gonna live in a, a nice nice rundown abandoned home in Shady Town very very far away. But anyway like I said I hope you guys enjoyed it and I will see you guys all in the very next video. Bye!